Hi, this is Dr. Dibakar Bhatt, a cardiothoracic and vascular surgeon uh, practicing at uh, Aster RV Hospital, JP Nagar, Bangalore. So I encounter a very common question, uh, what are the heart problems and in that what are these valvular problems? When do you do valve repairs? When do you do replacements? All those things. So for this one should know what are the valves? What do you mean by valves? Though heart is called as a muscle mass, uh, it's not so simple uh, organ. It's a very complex uh, structure and uh, uh, very much engineered by the God for so many centuries. And this has got a valves. They are nothing but a delicate structures inside the heart between the chambers. Their duty is to allow the blood flow in one direction. They are like security guards. Uh, whenever you see a security guard, he will allow people to move in one direction. The same way these valves are working like a security valves, uh, security guards inside of the heart. They allow blood flow from one chamber to another chamber. If they don't allow sufficient blood flow in one direction, then we call it as stenosis or obstruction. Instead of that, if they allow in reverse direction also, then we call it as valvular leakage or uh, regurgitation. So for all these things, we have a solution and these valves can be affected by so many diseases, rheumatic, degenerative, infective or any tumors. Rheumatic is nothing but uh, when somebody gets a throat infection during childhood, it leads to a cross infection to the heart valves and these heart valves can go either into a obstruction or a leakage. Same way degenerative, it is nothing but an aging process as we go on aging. Uh, these valves will have a wear and tear effect and they can have obstruction or uh, regurgitation that is called leakage. Infective endocarditis is nothing but infection of the heart which can specifically affect the valves and lead to a damage of the valve. There are certain tumors and certain myxomatous diseases which can affect the valve in a similar way. The detection of these heart valve problems is uh, most of the time patient will come with some sort of symptoms saying I have a difficulty in breathing, I cannot do my routine day-to-day uh, -day activities. And when such person approaches the doctor, our duty is to examine him. So we first listen to the patient, what are his complaints and accordingly we investigate. We do certain tests. The commonest test when uh, we do as a doctor is using a stethoscope and uh, hear his heart sounds. This is one of the easiest way. We call that as a murmur and most of the heart valvular problems can be detected by using a simple uh, stethoscope. Then the confirmation of this diagnosis is by a scanning of the heart that we call it as echocardiogram. Every one of you would have heard about that. Very simple test, no pain, just from outside we use that machine and identify the valve. Exact anatomy, we will tell exactly how much is the obstruction and leakage. Accordingly, we can either give medicine or we suggest them a balloon valvotomy. And if all these things fails, we do a repair of the valve or replacement using a metallic valve or tissue valve. So in, at Aster RV Hospital, we have facilities for all these things of uh, detection of these valvular problems and uh, treatment for all these things in a very effective and efficient way. Thank you.